What is going on everybody? It's nothing but skills and today we are going to be showing you guys how to get the new exotic holster. I haven't seen too many people really talk about this holster and it's pretty cool. If you have a holster that you're really not using and you haven't really put an exotic on there, this might be one that you can throw on there just depending on the type of build you're running. But overall the Imperial Dynasty is probably a pretty sick looking holster. Probably the best looking item in the game right now in my opinion. But what does this exotic do? So let's take a look at it. So the exotic holster has a talent called Dragon's Glare. While in combat, it applies burn to an enemy closest to you within 20 meters. Now the cooldown on this is 40 seconds. Now the way this actually works, we're going to take a look at it real quick. I have some gameplay. Whenever you get into combat, that first enemy that's near you, if you look at him, he got on fire, right? So this can happen every 40 seconds. That's what's pretty crazy about it. And the way you know is you see the little burn symbol above their head. It's actually really cool talent. If you look, the guy already started burning. He burned, he started burning before I even got to him, and that's what I like about it. And this whole feature of just getting close to him, once you're within those 20 meters, you can catch him on fire. It stuns them. That gives you a chance at destroying that enemy. And look at this one right here. Look, I'm just gonna run up to him. I'm not even gonna shoot. Look, he's he's burning. He's on fire. And then I start shooting him. It's so sick how this thing works. Check out this one, another one. Not even shooting at him. He's already on fire. And that's why I really like this whole thing. I think. It could be useful in certain situations, but how do you get it? So let's dive into that. So we have the stranded tanker right here, right? The stranded tanker. This is the mission that you guys want to do. You can do this on whatever difficulty. Now, if you look at the settlement, the haven to the east of it, we have this mission. This is the mission that you fight on Vivian Colony. And you can do this mission on whatever difficulty. I recommend if you can do it on challenging, do it on challenging because that gives you the ability to make mistakes. But once you get used to doing the mission, you can run through these pretty quick. And the boss is the one that has a chance of dropping this. Vivian is the only boss that I've heard that's dropped this. So you do have to run through the whole mission. But once you kill her, you just have to hope that when she goes in her, her mode of screaming, she ends up dropping it and she did look i was so excited when this happened i didn't even know i didn't even want to check it because i've been grinding for this i want to say not too long i think i did this mission about 10 times and it finally dropped for me but you remember exotics are total rng if you have bad rng now the rolls on this aren't perfect but i was excited to see it drop for me and she is the only one that drops this holster now for some reason somebody else has gotten this holster from some other way besides this boss please let me know in the comments but i'm pretty sure i want to say 95 percent sure that she's the only one that can get it even the talent dragon's glare kind of pairs up with the type of skill damage she does when she's trying to kill you but yeah this is where you guys get it for sure 100 percent. this is where i've seen most of my friends get it where everybody I know that I've asked, hey, where'd you get this? They've got it from here. Now I'm gonna start working on some builds around this holster because I really don't use too many exotics. And I'm thinking maybe some type of skill builds. Maybe maybe a shield tank build would work good with this. I think that's what I'm, I'm, I'm leaning towards. Probably one of those shield tank builds running this holster would actually work really good because when they get near you, you'll start to put, put some of them on fire. And with that talent, I can just I can just imagine how powerful this can be because I was just running this with a DPS build and being able to put them on fire and they start to to freak out they start to get stunned. It's a pretty cool talent to have on a holster when you're not really using exotics, and I think with a shield build where you could run one yellow, five blues, and get that full shield, this would actually pair up pretty good. I'm gonna keep working on the builds though with this and hopefully I can bring you guys something pretty cool um let me know what you guys think about this also do you think this is something that you could add to a build i'm gonna wrap up the video here don't forget if you're new first time watching any of my videos hit the subscribe button turn the notification below so when i release a video you guys get notified but let's wrap it up here i'll see you guys in the next one nothing but skills out